first method of creating templates of cloning is one of the easiest. On the action menu of the property record or any record that is in Expert Agent, scroll down to Letters, Emails, SMS, Create Letter, Email, SMS. And that will take you through to the template grid. On the Expert Agent default letters, we're going to be making sure that we are filtering on the correct format that we want to. So we're going to be looking at Word. Otherwise, we may by accident clone an HTML document, which we don't want to do at this point. So filtering on Word. To clone the template that you wish to, you don't click onto the name of it, that will create the template. So actually, we're going to click the Clone button to the left-hand side of it. That opens up the Edit Word template screen we've got the option of changing the description. So I'm just going to put a number in here so it appears at the top of the grid and clone. Template type is vendor because this is a price change letter for our vendors. Okay, if it was a price change letter for a lettings property, it would need to be the template type of landlord. Any template notes you can be adding in, things like, for example, must be printed onto the fancy paper, use the tray two in the main computer, must be printed onto header paper, whatever notes you need in here and that will flat, those will pop up as a little pop up but, uh, button when you hover over the template. You can create a task as well here and you can create a task on all letters um, on all templates, whether they're Word or HTML. Clicking create a task, you can then set who the task is for. So either the person who creates the letter or a specific negotiator. We're going to use the negotiator creating the letter and we're going to set the task date for two. The task text here So we've set this task to appear two days after we've created the letter on the negotiator who created the letter's task pod on their homepage. And the task text will be to remember to chase up the vendor regarding the price change. So it's an automatic task created whenever anybody uses this particular template. We can also assign an email template at this point as well. So when you send the letter out via email, you may want it to have a slightly different template. So you may want it to mention the price change that you discussed in there. You will need to create the price uh, the email templates though using HTML, which is all covered in our manual. You do have the option of opening the template and working with it now and the merge codes or if you're relatively happy with the wording of it for the moment, pressing the Save button will be a direct clone onto the R Letters tab. And there's our cloned document now ready for us to use.